So I just wanted to quickly go through some of the instructions on this punchline, give you an example about how you actually answer the punchline. The work itself is not bad, but the, the answering may be a little confusing. It says to graph each inequality, that's what we've been doing, and then it says circle the number letter pair for each statement that correctly describes the location of solutions, okay? That's the part that's a little weird. And then write that in the box at the bottom. So right here we've got negative x plus 2y is less than or equal to 4. So I'm going to do my work right here, which you will not do because you don't have room there. But you're doing this on the back or separate paper. And I am going to um, put that in slope-intercept form. So I'm going to add x to both sides. And I get 2y is less than or equal to x plus 4. And then I divide everything by 2. And I get y is less than or equal to 1 half x plus 2. So I put it in slope-intercept form. Then I'm going to graph. So my y-intercept is 2. I go up 1 over 2. And then I have to decide... Is it a solid or dash line? Well, it can equal the line, so that's going to be a solid line. And then I have to decide, does it go above or below the line? So if I plug in 0, 0, I get 0 is less than or equal to 0 plus 2, which is true, which means I shade below the line, okay? That's the easy part. Now, we have to decide if these are correct. So, are all points on the boundary line part of the solution? Well, this is the boundary line, and what they're asking here is, is the boundary line included? Well, if you made a solid line, the boundary line is included. So, this is a true statement, okay? Then, are all points below the line? This would be below the line, this would be above. Are all points below the line included? Well, that's where we shaded right? So that's included. So at the bottom, on number 10, you're going to write an R, and on number 4, you're going to write an I. Just to give another, um, to talk about the boundary line, this is a less than, so this would be a dashed line. So are the points on the boundary line going to be included here? No, because it's a dashed line, the boundary line is not included, so you will not be circling that one, okay? I'll let you graph it and decide whether you're going above or below the line. So that's how this punchline is going to be completed.